Our father came from uh, the San Luis Valley, a little town called San Luis. My uh, family and those that lived in that little town were impoverished. There was a tremendous amount of togetherness that they had. They lived off of the land. I mean, that's how they lived. My dad's family, they needed an opportunity. And a lot of those people from the San Luis Valley moved to Fort Collins to work over here at the sugar factory. My mother was, uh, I would call her a warrior because her mindset was, we're gonna be successful. Our family ended up living in what they called Andersonville and our little house is still there. It's the third house north of the tracks. Our parents were the type of parents that made us work, and, and we enjoyed working. Our parents taught us, hey, you're just an, a person. You do the best you can. You work as hard as you can, and people are going to like you. My dad had a focus for his family. He wanted his own trucks. He wanted his own business. In 1959, my dad says, uh, why don't we see if we can get a permit for trash hauling? He actually got the last permit that was issued. My dad says, why don't we just make it uh, GNS Sanitation, the Gallegos and Sons. We started out with one customer, 10 customers. You know, pretty soon we had three or 400 customers. My wife worked with me. We did all the billing and that kind of thing. And Jerry and Rudy were able to do the routing. We introduced the first hydraulic operated trucks that used compaction. The first roll carts in the city of Fort Collins. Now you see them everywhere. Today our customer base is between 40 and 50,000. If my dad was alive today, he would be so amazed. I know he would. It's all been family. It's worked out pretty good.